make saves at big times. Uh, they just came up with one more ugly goal than us. And uh, you know, I, don't, I don't think we wore down because of the puck possession or, you know, I just think they, they took 50 shots tonight. That's that's all, uh, you know, and eventually one of them fell in the back of the net. Line changes for them at all? Like, adjust anything you guys have to do or, or no. react to? Or? No, I, I don't think so, you know, and that's, that's something you'd have to ask coach. Uh, you know, I just, I get a tap on the shoulder, I go play. I don't worry about matchups or anything like that. Mark, you talked about all the shots they had. You guys did that to them three nights ago. Uh, were you unable to get as many shots tonight? What were they doing to make sure that they had so many more than you tonight? You know, I think they're they're pretty strong in their puck retrievals tonight. You know, uh, whether it be the D working together or uh, working as a five man unit to break pucks out, uh, we we just you know couldn't sustain any four checks, to turn pucks over, and really you know have those long offensive zone shifts to, to grind them down. Uh, you know, credit to them, uh, they stepped it up tonight. Uh, we were a step behind. We, we had to be better, and we just weren't tonight. On the road, you know they're going to push on the road Monday too, but uh, expect to have that extra jump playing back at home again. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, if they're going to push, I mean, what are we going to do? You know, it's back in our building. Our backs are against the wall. Uh, the teams, when there's adversity, this is the, the best this team's played all year. Uh, so I expect our first elimination game to be uh, everybody playing with their hair on fire.